Welcome back to Fudd's Plays Minecraft. Welcome back to my very noisy village. And I've got a few ideas what I want to do for today, but oh, let's get out of there first of all. But first of all, I'm going to show you what I've um, been doing in the village. Yep, you just saw my inventory there. Now, I've actually been building a lot in the village since you've been here last. And the roofs have actually been fixed. This house and one out down that end there is that very similar, which I'm looking back one cat was nicer. This house is actually a modification of another house. I do actually particularly like the roof of this one actually, it's quite a nice roof. Even though it looks a bit weird inside. I got this kind of blocky free door house here. Down here, I've got this corner house with this villager in it. Quite proud of this one, even though it's a bit different to all the other houses. Yeah, I've got golems now. This house, I like the roof of. It's actually got a lot of doors. You've got a door there, door there, and door there, door there, and a door there. And this door actually leads into a back garden here. Excuse me. <laughs> Let's carry on then. There's also another interesting house with side of the village. This one actually goes down level. We've got a weird window here. Up here. The reason I've done this one on two levels is it goes down here. I mean, this house is a very utilitarian village type thing, right in front of me, garden, which we've now managed to get some. some Technically, uh, farmers, even though I was a Fletcher, still works. It's quite a small five door workhouse. But I do like how it looks, it's very. The roof's a bit weird, but I do like the way it looks. But what I'm going to do today has nothing to do with this village. Oh yes, and we're growing some big trees. I don't do my extended plantation here either. Can you see it yet? It has a lot to do with this hill. I've also built a little walkway up the side of a hill. And he'll be coming around the mountain when he comes. Now I could have made dug into that mountain and made a staircase that way. Ouch. It'll probably be safer because let's face it, that hurt. Oops, sorry about that. Uh, you probably didn't see much of a cut because it did actually pause the game while I was sneezing. Let's get back up here. Let's eat as well, otherwise I'm going to die when I fall off again. You can actually see my little door down there, down to my mine shaft. You end goes around here, turns back the way. But around and around and up and up to this plateau here. With you might actually recognise the view actually, because I did actually use this as a thumbnail as one of my videos. A fantastic view of the entire village from up here. See? But what I'm actually gonna do up here, now I'm actually up here. 
is this is going to be my main castle. Now I've got my home in the village, which is nice. It's not going to be a permanent home. Also, that dirt pillar there is important. There's actually a zombie spawner directly underneath it. It's the one I found while I was caving. Um, and I want to try and keep it. There's also that little mini plateau there, which I'm going to create a tower on. What I'm going to do here is I've got with me lots of cobblestone. Also, there's the other village over there. So, I'm going to start laying out the foundations and the border for my castle. I think I'm going to have it up here. Okay, there'll be lots of me placing blocks this, this episode. There we Remembered, I didn't actually bring a bed up here. So let's try and light this place up then. I'm not going to lay down a proper torch wheel up here. I'm also going to try and run downstairs and sleep the night away in a moment. Especially since I'm now out of torches. Going up is the easy part, going down is more difficult. I've tried to put this on half slabs wherever possible. Down the slow way. Otherwise known as a safe way. There we are, back in town. Villages all sort of in their homes. So that guy decided to stand outside for a night. I'm actually going to take a bed up there with me. I'm going to make a bed and bring it up with me. Or at least bring supplies to make a bed up there. I'll keep my wood in this chest. Yep, I'll use it. Very sorry. Just to get him out of my inventory. I'm also going to make some torches while I'm here. Hmm. So I spent most of the weekend just gone actually while I'm watching the Mindcrack Marathon. Um, oh, a zombie there. Burning away merrily. Let's help him grab it. Or not. Oh well. Yeah, that watched most of the weekend watching a mind crack marathon. A brilliant guy, brilliant job by those guys raising uh, $208,000. That's something like 138000 quid. 
uh, for charity over weekend. I mean, you got Yogg's Gas Crew doing the same sort of thing. Was it Yogg's Gas Crew or something else? I know there's been lots of charity events going on last weekend because it was the Extra Life game day. But as a fan of Mindcrack, I was definitely watching their stream and, what, and cheering them on, donating as I went. Again, I'm not very rich, so I wasn't able to donate much, but I donated a bit. We help them get their way as far as they can. So now that's a bad idea. That's a bad idea. That's a bad idea doing that there. I'll tell you what, I'm sneezing a lot today, so I may have to cut this video short because it's going to get way too noisy. Going all this cobblestone. Again, this is not going to be the shape of my building up here, it's just going to be the outer wall. I might actually dig into a mountain a bit to actually get the wall shape. Doing right. Soon. I'm going to do it like this for a very good reason. Next time we come back, I might have actually built something inside of this. I don't know yet. Not sure exactly what's going inside here. I'm not that good at castle building. No, I'm not really that good at building anyway.
Okay, so let's light up the wall. Again, I'll show you why, I'm, uh, why I did that particular bit of wall different. I do need to be careful running around here because it is, especially here, it gets to be a very big drop. I've also named my pick, if you didn't case that, I've named my pick. Now the reason why this one is lower is because this one is eventually going to go down here to that. There's water down there, but I can't actually drop into it sadly. Yeah, I do like why the village looks more pretty, and very half the village isn't loaded in properly. I'm going to build more houses there and there, and my houses there as well. I may abandon the idea of having two villages connected together. But I may toy with the idea of having one that village over there. Uh, where was it again? The village over there converted instead of a village into a village of breeder. And just go AFK there, and breed villagers just in case I need to ship some over. And so minecart rail. So yeah, I've now got the uh, wall to my keep here. That's what I was looking for earlier keep. We're relatively mob proof, there's probably one or two places where mobs can spawn. One place where I definitely can get in though is here. So, what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to put down my crafting table right there, like that, and create myself some doors. So, I'm going to take down my Halfway here, let me get my spruce wood ready. That needs to be stone as well, then. A wooden door there. And yeah, let's now get my stairs ready and my shovel. And yeah, that makes make this the official entrance into the area. No, that's not there. The biggest worry about tonight is for mob spawning and just wandering up and blowing me off. Nope, so let's get rid of that and let's turn off the a bit of a layer here. And that looks a bit more natural now. Except for that. And the other thing I need up here, just for it to light, is of course. A chest to drop all this rubbish in. Let's drop my coarse dirt and the cobblestone and all the building materials I'm not going to be using immediately in there. And let's sleep the night away up here. Set my spawn up here as well. And I'm going to end the episode here. Like I say, I've been sneezing a lot today, so I can't exactly carry on recording right now. It was my pleasure what, uh, recording. Have a lovely rest of the day. Thank you very much for watching. Remember to check out the rest of my videos. Like and subscribe to my channel. Bye bye.